Design right now is needing to be more impactful. We have to look at, you know, psychologically, what are people thinking? What are the sound, the smell, the look, the lights, everything that's so nuanced? It's really about what sort of, you know, where are you touching them emotionally? The meaning of design is much deeper than just nice spaces. Is this really something where I can address a really difficult subject matter and bring change about through design and through what I'm doing? The ideas that we can introduce they talk about the way that we think, this narrative, scenographic way that we think, or this way of designing from the inside out, really brings a completely different level to design. Our uh, graduate program has two very distinctive tracks. Um, one is spatial experience, and then we have the furniture and fixture side. I think what's very unique about both of our programs is that it's really highly structured from an industry point of view. Understanding brand, understanding manufacturing, and what is the whole making process for mass production. So design research in the graduate level is huge. We tap sociology, psychology, engineering, architecture, and interior design. We do this in, uh, allows us to go deeper into issues that we wouldn't in undergraduate and develop our ideas further. You're not looking at just the holistic approach to like a space, but like how the space activates the surrounding area and how it affects the people who go into the space. You need to make sure that Everything that you're putting out that interacts with the human being needs to be curated because you're trying to evoke a particular emotion in a particular space. You constantly have to know about what's happening in dining, what's happening in retail, what's happening in architecture, what's happening with policy making. You, you constantly try to incorporate so many things into your design and that's why environmental design is so powerful. We really try to find every specific strength and areas where we can help and do a very, very tailored education. And it's, uh, for me, very, very fascinating, especially in the grad program, to see, because our students come from so many different countries in the world. We have a very close relationship with all of our students. We're a relatively small program that allows us to tailor each student's interests and needs to the vision that they have coming in, and we aim to broaden that vision. I think being together here as a community, um, learning a lot about each other, we're always together. Uh, really brings that camaraderie. Just knowing how they approach the same problem as I am, I think that's something that I really try to constantly look out for. Follow your heart and do what you yearn for. If you create a space and it has a certain influence on you, people can experience joy, which trigger certain emotions, certain feelings. This is an enormous gift. I've watched students come in thinking they were one kind of designer and leaving completely someone new and they've truly blossomed as people, as designers, and we're immensely proud of them. If you really talk to people who say, you know, I really want to be impactful with people, those are the folks that show up on our doorstep. How do you create something new and different for them and fresh for them? It takes a lot more openness and it takes a lot more effort on the uh, part of the creative, but I think what comes out on the other side is extremely inspirational.